Hi folks, Wes from FV MBA here. Just want to show you guys how you can use the Trail Forks app to record a new trail that you're going to propose for your local riding area and then how you can take that proposed new trail and put it onto a uh, collaborative Google map that you are sharing with uh, other users in the area where you're planning some trails. Now the first thing that you're going to need to do is download the free Trail Forks app from the App Store so you can get that for your iPhone or your Android phone. So download and uh, get that open. Once you're in the Trail Forks app, uh, you need to have a user account for using Trail Forks. It's free. Uh, at the bottom here where it says create one on pinkbike.com, go ahead and create uh, a username and then put in your email address and the password that you want to use for your Trail Forks account and then just write that down somewhere so that you can uh, keep track of it. Okay, so I'm going to log in here. Use my pink bike username. Okay, so here I am in the Trail Forks app. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the map, and uh, at the very top of the uh, the map, you can see the the record button. So with Trail Forks, you can look around at the different areas on the map and see all the different mountain bike trails that are in your vicinity. So here, if we go up, say, to the Hope area, we can see here we've got just a couple of trails shown. Uh, but if there are more trails in this area that exist, uh, you can start recording where those trails are and then get them, first of all, into Trail Forks. And then uh, if they're just in the proposal stage, uh, walk that route in Trail Forks. And then we'll put it into Google Maps, and I'm going to show you how to do that. So at the top of the screen where you see that uh, yellow icon with the plus symbol on it, just click on it and choose record ride. So even if you're just going to be hiking the new trail, that's fine. Uh, hiking or walking, however you're going to just show where that new trail is, uh, walk along the route, hit record ride. At the bottom of the screen here, uh, you're going to see that it's going to get a GPS signal and then it's going to start recording. Uh, so once that's done here, so start walking the route along the trail. So uh, do this at the start of the trail. Once you've gotten to the end, uh, hit stop and then you can hit save and this will save your trail and upload it to Trail Forks. Now this isn't going to be a public trail so I'm going to turn off the public button so it's just going to be private. Uh, I'm not going to worry about syncing it to Strava and I'm just going to call this proposed new trail. Okay once that's done uh, I'm going to save it and it's going to upload to Trail Forks and at that point here you're going to need to go to a desktop computer so that we can get the trail information from the Trail Forks website and then move it over to our Google Map.